everyone, this is Rabbit Care New Zealand and I thought I would just do a little bit of a haul video for you guys. I picked up a few things over the last week or two, so I thought I'd just do a collective haul and show you what I got. It's a bit of a mix and match. I've got some bird stuff and I've got some rabbit toys, treats and food. So I'll just show you what I got from the local pet store. So I did buy, it is empty because I've popped it into the, the um, food hole, the food bin, but this is, I did buy a bag of the Burgess XL Tasty Nuggets for Adult Rabbits. Um, so these are the UK pellet food that we have only just recently gotten to New Zealand, so it's pretty exciting when we got this, because I've seen the Burgess XL on a lot of people's channels, and I really like it, it's really good food, but I will do a review on this food at some point, um, just what how I felt it, how, how why I chose it, and how good I, how I feel about it, I guess. But yeah, so I picked up a bag of that. So that is two kgs. Um, I don't really have the receipts with me, but I'm pretty sure it's about twelve dollars ninety two for that. So that's a bag of food that I got. So that was from the pet store. I also picked up a new brush. So I do have a um, slicker brush and nail clippers, which are the main ones that I use. But um, we got in, the Animate's got a new brand of um, grooming equipment in for small animals by Living World. So, um, and I thought this brush was quite good. It's like a porcupine brush, but I thought it was quite nice just to smooth the coat up after using the slicker brush, so I, I grabbed one of those just to have something else in my little grooming kit. I also grabbed a um, couple of these little wood chews, so I think the brush was about $6, I think these chews were about $6. Um, I've already given one to Bella, as you can see, it's kind of missing its top, so I just popped it back in the packet just to show you guys what they are, and I gave um, this one here to Dustin, but he hasn't really touched it, but she's definitely had a good nibble off the top, but I thought it was just something, it's quite a, um, it out. they're quite hard wood, so it's quite a different material, it's got like this corn starchy tops, which she's had a good chew on, but yeah, it's quite a hard material, so I thought it was just something a bit of a different texture. I did buy it more for Bella because Dustin doesn't really chew things like this, but I did give him one just in case he was interested, so I'll pop that there. And then I also picked up a bag of the uh, Tui Pet Premium Gourmet Rabbit Guinea and Guinea Pig Treats. So these are from the Tui Pet Company who also make a range of food. They also do um, bird treats and bird foods and stuff as well. Um, and I have showed these in my diet video. But yeah, it's, it's kind of just a, a big block treat. I think there's 15, 15 pieces. So this lasts me quite a while. I haven't even opened it yet because I haven't quite finished my other one. But I thought I'd pick that up. It's only about $3. So I thought they'd pick that up while I was at there just to um, add to the treat jar when I've finished up all the others. So the next few things I bought were actually online. So um, I've shopped before at a company, an uh, online store called Little Shinters, which is a really, really cool company. It does um, lots of things for chinchillas and rabbits and guinea pigs, and they're all handmade and stuff like that. So it is expensive, but I did really, really want some things off there, so I did a bit of an order. So one of the first things, which was the reason I ordered off it, is to buy this little Little Shinters Tasty Titbits Rabbit Mix. Now, this stuff, um, the Burgess XL company makes a lot of forage and treats like that, um, but we can't really get them in the country. So I found this on Little Shinters, which I thought was quite similar. So it's got lucerine, chaff, grass chaff, rolled oats, rosehip, bilberries, lavender, marshmallow root, and chickweed. And its fiber is 26%, protein 17, fat 4. So it's got quite a high fiber content. And it says, feed one tablespoon per rabbit per day as a treat, either sprinkled over pellets or offered separately. So, just show you what it looks like. It smells quite good. Um, and what I've been doing with it, I'll just take a little put it in my hand and show you. So that's what it looks like. You can see the oats and nice green grass and all that kind of stuff. So what I've actually been doing in it is I've been putting a, a teaspoon over um, Bella's and Dustin's pellets in the evening, just as a little bit of an extra fiber. So it, this one was quite expensive. I think it was seven dollars or nine dollars fifty but it is a i think it's 500 grams or 300 grams or something like that 
and it will last me quite a while. I'm not going to use it that quickly. I'm only using little bits, to be honest. So that was one of the reasons I ordered off them. That's one thing I've been wanting for a little while. And um, so while I was buying that, I thought oh, I might as well buy something else as well because the postage is like $8 or $7.50. So I was like, oh, well, you know, I might as well pick some other stuff instead of just buying one thing which is pretty much the same price as the postage. So I got these cute little toys. Um, I know this one's called the Queen of Hearts, and this one is, I don't know what this one is, but um, I bought a long, when I eventually do a toy, um, all, of the, all of the rabbit's toys, I will show it, but I bought a centipede one, which was probably twice as long as this one with similar material with this bamboo stuff and wood and willow balls and all that and Dustin is one of the only toys Dustin really has a go at um, I think it was in my haul actually uh, not my haul my one of my my rabbit cage tool my first video so yeah it's um he loves these material he loves having to chew on it uh, so I thought I'd pick up another one and then I thought this thing was really cute so it's still got the bamboo riffs it's got a um wood piece in the middle and then I think they're just little willow hearts up here and I just thought that was really cute I don't know who's getting what I was kind of tempted to give this one to Bella and that one to Dustin because they are separate at the moment um, but he has one like this so I almost thought and this one's quite girly to be honest so I almost thought I might actually give that to Bella and give that to Dustin but I have absolutely no idea if he's going to touch it which to be honest if he doesn't I'll just give it to Bella anyways so it's not really a big deal but yeah and it's got actually noticed little wood shoes in there as well so I thought those were adorable so they're from little shinters um I think they were about one of them was seven and one of them was nine I think I spent 30 something 38 dollars altogether or something like that so um yeah one one or the other I can't remember what the prices were exactly but yeah I did there are quite expensive toys on there for like 25 dollars but and they're huge like they're quite big and they're all handmade and they're beautiful but it's just a little bit above my budget to be honest so yeah that is um what i got from little shinter so i'll move that over here and then this stuff which isn't really this isn't rabbit stuff but it's still exciting so i thought i'd show you guys anyways so um i've got a love bird and she's when i first got her she was on a seed diet um and so i bought a cockatiel seed when I first got her because she was used to that diet and I've been trying to slowly wean her off it and get her onto a better diet. So what I do make for her is chop. So that's just a mixture of veggies and um, all that that I pretty much put in the food processor, make a whole three weeks worth of it, bag it in the freezer and then defrost it each day for her breakfast. But, um, and then I would have just, I just add a cockatiel seed to that. But now that I've finished my cockatiel seed, I went to Quality Bird Supplies and I bought a whole... Up quite a lot of actually healthy seed to add to her chop all, and have it all together and give it to her. So um, I got two kgs of each. I got, um, this is rape seed, panicum, French white millet, and linseed. Oh, they're all going to fall. Okay, anyways, so that's linseed there. So I got two kgs of each, so it's eight kgs of um seed pretty much i have used a little bit but um i've put it in a i've put it all together mix it all together in a container so that's in the cupboard so it is less than two at the moment but um this is going to last me ages hopefully um and i just thought you know the seed is much healthier for her so i've kind of got it so that i can mix it through her chop and get her off the cockatiel seed i also do a um, bit of soak seed for her as well which is just something it's just a seed mix that you sprout you soak and sprout, and sprouted seed is much healthier for birds because it just, um, when they sprout, they tend to release a higher, you know, the nutrient quality um, increases by heaps when they sprout, so it's their best time to feed it to them. So, yeah, that was not really rabbit-related, but I thought I was pretty excited. I think it cost me, like, $38 for all of this plus shipping, and he literally, the guy's great. You just email him, and he tell him what you want, and he will literally send you any size. Um... I think they were about $7 or $8 for two kgs. And it was 38 in total. Shipping was relatively cheap. And he literally, my money must have got to him by Wednesday. And I had these arrived on Friday, I'm pretty sure. Thursday or Friday. So he was super duper quick. It was great. So, yeah, that was just a little bit of a non-rabbit related thing. But something I was still quite excited about. So I thought I'd just share you guys anyways. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much everything I got. I will be... Um, 
probably doing a review on a few of these things, like the Little Shinters Tasty Tidbits and the Burgess XL. But yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that. And thank you for watching. Bye.